this actually looks like a jungle. Good job, Tim. So, uh, I thought today would be a fantastic time to start the 2021 YouTube journey with a studio tour because uh, I've been in this space for about a year, a little over a year. I think it's about 15 months and this place has changed and I finally think it's perfect. It is so perfect that I, I'm confident enough to show it off. And uh, I just wanna know what you guys think. Obviously, I'm gonna start at the door, which uh, now you're in the bedroom. This is where everything happens from my meals, to my sleeping, to my creating, to the photo shoots, to everything. Okay, so this is my side of the bed. You will notice that there is a pillow missing. That's cause my wife is sleeping in the living room because she works night shift. She is a nurse. She has been working her ass off this past year. So I'm just gonna plug this. Everybody just wear your mask. Go get a vaccine, okay? Just, ah, uh, stop giving them a hard time. Anyway, moving on right here, we have my most favorite humidifier. It is fantastic. I have severe allergies to cats and dust and I own a cat and I live in an old mill which happens to have a lot of dust. So this kind of helps my breathing but on the other side it also helps all of my plants because I have a ton of tropical plants that need high humidity. So it kind of like serves two purposes. I keep two in this room. And here we got more plants and over here is my what was supposed to be my gear shelf but it kind of turned into half gear half plants. Let's start at the bottom. Uh, this is where all my tripods and articulating arms and like lights go. I just took that Joby off the camera I'm holding right now. This is like a desk ring light. All these boxes are stuff I need to do unboxing videos for. And then over here, I got this from Ikea. It was either seven or $10. I think it's for like your underwear, socks, your knickers, I don't know. Uh, but what I use it for is my very built-in D filters, like miscellaneous. I've got portable batteries, battery packs. This one is a battery pack and a light. Now come up top and this is where all the cameras are. Here's my EOS R. I'm currently filming on the RP, again, video do, all of my lenses, my first DSLR camera, my first ever camera, this is what started it all. I'm not a very sentimental person to begin with, but this, I swear, from the sixth grade up until when I graduated, this thing came with me everywhere. Um, a bunch of lenses up there. Over here, I just have a bunch of plants. And then up here, I have way more plants. Here is a big ass plant. There's another big ass plant. This spot right here is mine and my wife's favorite spot. This is what we call the selfie corner. It's like a jungle. Just look at the vibe off. Oh my God, I should stop saying the word vibe. Uh, but just look at the whole mood. Can I say mood? I'm gonna say mood. It's the mood it gives off. It's perfection. Then a bunch of more stuff. This is what I call my propagation station. Anyway, I got some of my rare plants, some expensive stuff in there. Here's another bit. Here is the rest of the desk. I will be doing another video on this, just like a desk tour. Uh, but moving on over here, it's just a bunch of plants. More plants up there. Here's a closet and more plants. I'm running out of breath. Whew. And I think that is it. I think the last thing I wanted to talk about or touch on was how I keep this space. Now this space doesn't just work as a YouTube set. It also works as the, the space I work out of. Uh, I edit here, I eat here, I sleep there. Uh, it has to make me want to stay and do it on a daily basis, which is why I have so many plants. And so yeah, that is the room tour. Like I said, I, it's finally perfect, which is why I'm comfortable enough showing it to all of you. But if you're one of the 200 people that have been here since the get-go of this channel, you know that every single time I do a studio tour, I uh, 
I move out. And I know the hat's a continuity issue, but my hair's a mess, and I'm not about to show you that. But yeah, um, this chapter's done. On to the next one. Okay, where do I start? So five, five.